It's Fox and Friends. <laughs> Meanwhile, does Uncle Sam own you? Our next guest says that the government certainly thinks so with the way it takes money out of our pockets to pay government employees. But he's here to tell Uncle Sam, no, you don't. Jim McDougald is the president of the Free Enterprise Nation which represents individuals and businesses in the private sector to demand an end to irresponsible government spending, redistribution, debt, and tax policies. And he joins us today from Tampa. Good morning to you, Jim. Good morning. That's a very powerful uh, message, and you get the message across. I own you. He used to want us. Now he owns us. Yes, he now owns us. He now wants to tell us what to do instead of asking us what to do. Uh huh. And now one of the things that really bothers uh, the Free Enterprise uh, Institute that you're at is the fact that there is such a disparity between the, you know, the complete package that state and uh, local and federal employees get versus people who work in the private sector, right? Explain that. Yes, indeed. And by the way, it's a free enterprise nation.org. Uh, it's not an institute. But the uh, big disparity is the average federal government employee earns exactly twice as much as the average private sector employee. And the average government employee that doesn't work for the government, for the federal government, but does work for a state or a county, earns 50% more than the average private sector employee. And they don't know this. So we're trying to draw attention to that as well as to the health reform package that is cramming down the throats of Americans, uh, things that are going to interfere with their individual rights. Sure. say it's time for us to stop that. Uh, well, uh, Jim, I live in New Jersey, and of course now uh, New Jersey famously has got a lot of these very rich pension plans for employees of the state and the local as, as well. But a deal is a deal, and if you wind up uh, negotiating that deal, you would think that uh, they would be entitled to that. And I know what you're concerned about is going forward to have less sweet deals for employees, right? Is that fair? Well, yes, except it's more serious than that. The, the states currently owe about $3 trillion more than they've told the taxpayers they do because they have unfunded liabilities for their pension plans that they've calculated in a way that aren't legitimate. Um, what they're going to have to do is what we did in the private sector. They're going to have to vest everybody 100% in what they've got and then start over with a defined contribution plan like we have in the private sector. All right. Well, it's great uh, talking to you. We thank you very much for... Uh Shedding a little light on that, uh, Jim McDougald, the president of the Free Enterprise Nation, joining us today from Tampa. Thanks, Jim. Thank you.